dead. What's up? Ninja Moses with you today. I know you like the ninja mask. It's not a ninja mask. I like to call it a ninja mask. But anyway, it helps me with my allergies. Okay? Alright? Health is number one, people. If you haven't been checked out, go to the doctor. Make sure everything is nice and right and tight where it's supposed to be. But I digress. 2019 Bowman Baseball Hobby. Full case. Number 21. It's time. All right. So there it is. Got the entire the uh, table on the screen there. Abraham, here he is. Good luck, everybody. Thank you, Abe. Let me take a little sip of my uh, my little smoothie. Yeah, I should have something to eat, but this will do me right. Alrighty, here we go. Vladdy come out to play one time for the one time who else is watching the uh, the, the MLB all-star game The AL and the NL tied 0-0. Zero, zero. At the top of the second. What if you hit a super fractor guard? Well, there's also that, man. see what we got here good luck everybody let's make it do what we do there's a paper it's not going anywhere Diaz Cameron Tigers cracked ice is it just me or could we do a little bit lighter there I think that looks good Dash Cameron Tigers, cracked ice.
My boy wanted Santana. Let's do it. Wow, some players have like cameras on their helmets in the All-Star game. That's kind of crazy. Probably get some cool shots with those. Was that a GoPro or something? There's our first autograph. Kyle Wright to 499 Braves rookie autograph. So Braves with a hit right there. Eagle Garb, a little something for you there. Got Lion Richardson, 125 Reds. Yeah, here, Jordan is going up right now. I forgot to change the Astros price to 5000 Dustin May, 499 Dodgers. One box down.
Bellinger didn't participate. I mean, not Bellinger. Yelich didn't participate in the Derby, but he's playing in the All Star game. Interesting. Need some mojo in this box. Blaze Alexander, four ninety nine D bags auto. So far, it's been all Garvey. Kind of sucks when the auto comes out that quickly. Then the rest of the box is like blah. Sam, I'm dude. I'm not a. I'm not. A, I'm barely a guy, bro. I'm barely a guy. What is it, Royce Lewis to twenty five here? Very nice. Would have been nicer if that was an actual auto. But yeah, dude. I mean, not sure if you know this, uh, Garv. <coughs> Excuse me. But I don't I don't know anything about baseball. Combine that with my minimal and I do mean minimal knowledge on cards. I, I don't even know why I'm a breaker. Because I'm entertaining, that's why. But yeah, dude, uh, I have no idea what any of this... Like, I have no idea what I'm looking at right now. Like, I could hit a $10,000 card and have no idea. You know what I mean? Got Royce Lewis, 299 Twins here. But, you know, I do try to be as entertaining as possible and, you know, happy-go-lucky and, and all that good stuff. <coughs> 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 I will say, I'm pretty knowledgeable as far as basketball and football, you know, as far as the sport is concerned, but yeah, again, as far as, you know, the card game and, and whatnot, every day is a learning experience for me, man. Matt Manning of the Tigers, Crack Dice. That's why you know, I really enjoy doing this, man, because you know, I learn more and more about this stuff and, you know, slowly get more and more into the hobby. Like, I have, uh, I have a few cards that have been gifted to me that are part of my now personal collection. It, it's pretty cool, man. Oh, 
Oh, well, yeah, I mean, listen, I, I've ripped enough Bowman to know what I'm looking at, if that's what you're worried about. I don't think I've missed any numbered cards yet. Like, this is not a numbered card. Ooh, one of one, Mojo. A Victor Mesa Jr., not Victor Victor, but Victor Mesa. One of one printing plate for the Marlins. Not bad. No, for sure, Garv. I appreciate that, man. I appreciate that. That way I can improve, baby. So Marlins, one of ones are considered a hit. So there you go. But yeah, dude, I'm pretty familiar with the with the cards and you know what's inserts and, and stuff like that. So no worries. I'm gonna try things differently on this one. Of the auto will come out a little bit later in the break. Now, how come they don't have a rookie game in baseball? That would be cool. Instead of doing a celebrity game, which is bullshit, why don't they have like a rookie game, like a rookie sophomore game in baseball? That would be dope as hell. Or they could do like a they could do a rookie a rookie versus like a triple A like the All Stars and the Triple A. That would be cool. But like that All Star Celebrity game, that is that's such bullshit. You know what I mean, Billy? That would be cool, dude. Like seeing, you know, the all-stars, like the best triple-A players go up against the rookies in the, in, in the majors. That would be really dope to see. here in this third box I want to see a super fract or something stupid nice for somebody especially someone that hasn't got a hit in a while let's get him a big hit here Bowman Schumer for Anthony Siegler, 3 of 25 Yankees. That orange, always nice.
think I see an orange back there. They have two oranges in this box. Hopefully an auto. Not numbered. We got Brent Honeywell to twenty five rays. So two orange parallels in this box. Would be nice if they can match it with an orange auto. The AL up one O. Cedric Mullins, the rookie autograph, Orioles. Orioles with a hit there. Man, Garvey continuing the hot streak. My man got all the autos so far. Got a long way to go, Garv. We're only three boxes in, man. Nine left, so. Patience is a virtue. Ryan Richardson, Reds cracked eyes. Oh, they got three Astros in the outfield? That's hilarious. Cornelius Martinez, Blue Jays, 499. Yeah, I call them crack dies, but yeah, it's it's the the atomics. Four right now. Jose Barrios out here wheeling and dealing.
see what we got. Box four. Those, that little blue color there always throws me off. Stewie Ruiz Padres Atomic. Kershaw Atomic to 150, the facsimile insert, very nice. Chad Spanberger to 25 Blue Jays. Here's a little color. Will Stewart. Gold to 50 for the Phillies. Very nice. There you go, Phillies for Raul. A little gold action. Let's start filling that jumbo. Ten teams left in jumbo. So we can uh, knock that out right after this is done. Miguel Amaya, 499 Cubs. Here's box five.
I hate when that happens. All these little suction cups. Right back to business. Ronnie Mauricio with the Mets autograph. Mets with a hit.
Atomic, Gavin Lux, Dodgers. Sean Murphy, A's to 250. We're halfway. This is box six.
What you got for me, book six? I mean, box six. Justin Dunn, Mariners Atomic. Yadi Molina, 250 Cardinals. Will Smith, 499 Dodgers. Swaggerty, 150 Pirates. Keegan Thompson of the Cubs, the 290 White Spargo Auto. What up, Garv? I'm sorry. Uh, what up, Rara? How you doing today? Wait, what team was that? The Cubs? Yes. Patrick with a hit with his team in the failure. Very nice. Ronnie Mauricio, 125 minutes. Yeah, we got the we got a jumbo case in the store with about ten. I think it's ten teams left, so I think we can fill that tonight.
take a little brake chisel. I will do no such thing, Rara. Don't you know there's money in that? Sorry, I was texting a friend just now. If you could not hear me, type no one.
Need something big here for somebody. I'm on box seven right now. Why are you doing this to me? Why? Atomic for Monte Gall, White Sox. Ram Velotti, 299 Rockies. Definitely better, Garv, but infinitely more stressful. Like, I, I can't even begin to tell you how stressful this is. So, yeah, you know, I, I'm making a little bit more money. Than I was working at, I mean, yeah, a little bit more. You know, UPS, I had benefits and stuff like that. And I was making good money working there, you know, I'm not going to lie to you. But, eh, making a little bit better money now. Except, you know, I have to take account for my tax. I got to pay taxes at the end of the year. And I don't have any benefits either, so I have to pay for my health insurance and all that crap. So, when you take that stuff into account, it's slightly better than UPS, uh, but it, it is it is infinitely, infinitely more stressful. Like, I, again, I, I can't even begin to tell you the stress that I go through on a daily basis. Like, even on my days off, man. I'm looking at the store. I'm, you know, I'm responding to people's messages and emails and, and, and you know, the social media stuff. And, you know, I'm watching Jason's streams to make sure that, you know, he's not losing his mind. And it, it's 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 a constant, nonstop worry. You know, when you're your own, I'm not really my own boss, but I can. I am my own boss. You know, make my own hours and all that stuff, but yeah, it's it's infinitely more more stressful. You know, at UPS, you know, I just had to worry about you know my time there, and once I clocked out, boom, I'm clocked out. The rest of my day is mine. You know, I, I don't have to worry about nothing else after that. But you know, when when you run your own business and stuff like that, I've learned that. It's a lot more stressful, man. You know, working the 9 to 5 is, is pretty cool in the sense that, it, you know, you put your time in. Again, once you clock out, you know, you're, you're free. Not so much here. I'm always clocked in, you know. Not really, Garv. I mean, I, I you know, it's it's complicated. I don't want to go into to detail, but I, I do get a percentage. Uh, I do get a nice chunk of percentage. The problem is, when I first started breaking, I wasn't breaking. You know, I, I would probably... Ooh, that is very nice. 25 of 25. eBay 101, Eloy Jimenez, White Sox. That is a very good hit. Very nice. There you go, Trey. But yeah, like I was saying, man. Uh, yeah, dude. You know, if, if I don't sell anything, I don't get paid anything. So that first year of breaking was extremely tough, man. Um, you know, I, I dipped into my savings. I spent all my savings. You know, I dipped into my 401k. I took that out early. 
So I had to pay a penalty for that. All because I just didn't want to ask Gail for money. Because I wasn't selling anything. And, you know, I got through about half the year doing that until finally, you know, I had I had spent all the money I had saved up and, and you know, the money I had in the 401k. So at that point, I was just like, you know, at that point, I was like, all right, you know, I, I got to start asking for money. But, you know, he, he helped me out. You know, he, he's definitely been helping me for sure. But, yeah, dude, that first year was extremely rough. You know, I, I was maybe breaking a box every two or three days. A box. One box. Like, every two or three days. And... I, I don't know I don't know how or when it happened but eventually you know after that first year you know slowly but surely you know I started filling one case a day two cases a day three cases a day and yeah man just been improving learning more about the product what people like so on and so forth just learning more about the hobby too because Again, I, I don't collect cards. I don't sell. I don't buy this stuff. And I, and I have no interest to either, to be honest with you. But from a business standpoint, you know, I could see the potential in this. And it does give me, it, it, it does give me some flexibility as to, you know, other ventures. Like now, now that I've, now that I've done this, for about three, three, three years or so, I feel like if I if I wanted to make a YouTube channel or like a podcast or something like that, I think I could be successful if I put enough time into that. Just based off of this, you know, the that I can talk to you guys in the chat, you know, every day, and you know, some of y'all find me entertaining, and you know, some people have even told me to to try to be a stand-up comedian or some stupid shit like that. So it's been, it's definitely been a positive experience. I've learned a lot, you know, not, not just about people, but about myself and what I'm capable of, you know, when I put my mind to it and whatnot. I'd be lying to you if I said I was a salesman, though. Definitely not that. I go off pure moxie. Pure moxie is what I got, what I bring to the table. I don't think I, I'm definitely not big time yet, Ra Ra. You know, some of these other breakers have been breaking for like 10 years plus. You know, it, it's kind of hard to compete with that. You know, that's another thing I've learned about this hobby is, you know, people tend to break with one or two, maybe three people. You know what I mean? So for me, that was, that was the thing. I, I just, I had to put my time in. I, I had to, you know... What's the word I'm looking for? I had to pay my dues. And surely and surely, you know, surely enough I've and I've improved. This is true, Ra Ra. We definitely don't do that. But yeah, I, I do try to entertain the people and and make up for my lack of knowledge that way. Through just pure sheer entertainment and and talking nonsense. So, Garb, man, you know, I, I appreciate you breaking with me, man. I know you've been breaking with Jason too, uh, you know. But but I do appreciate all of you actually for helping me put food on the table, baby. Anthony Siegler, for the Yankees.
Yeah, Chad is a uh, Chad is what Firehand. And that's a, that's another reason uh, that I like to go to the Nationals, because you know I get one I get to meet people, but you know I also get to talk to other breakers that you know we're obviously in competition with one another. Uh, but some breakers are really cool, man. Some breakers are very very cool, like the like the the vintage Briggs guys. Um, even though we're not in business together anymore, the Jaspy guys are really awesome. Um, uh, obviously I know Nasty Breaks yeah, and I just you know try to soak up that knowledge man try to learn more about the hobby and you know tricks of the trade and whatnot. And it, it's a rough gig, man. It's a rough gig. You know, if, if you don't sell nothing, you don't get paid anything. So in, in that sense, it's it's extremely, extremely stressful. But, you know, you, you got your good days, you got your bad days. Costello. 225 Twins. Oh, damn, Garvey, you've been around since, like, the beginning. Jose Suarez to 499 Angels autograph. Rara's knowledge is invaluable. Daisy with a little something there. Bottom of the fifth, the AL up two O. No more Mondays. A Colorado school district moves to four-day weeks. And I live in Florida. Ain't that a bit? Logan Allen, Padres, Atomic. Gold paper, and you have the Los Santos to 50 Phillies. How was your weekend, Ra Ra? I don't think I saw you yesterday. Yesterday was a pretty short stream been uh, dealing with these chest pains and they've really been stressing me out but uh, feeling a lot better today for sure
almost done. Four boxes left. They did. They do, Garvey. But, you know, I was just looking for other opportunities. And UPS paid well. They, they did. I just, I wasn't a fan of the politics and the kiss-assing and, and all that bullshit that comes along with, you know, working for a company. And, you know, the benefits were good. And, and yeah, they, they did pay good money, but... I just, I was not happy. I wasn't satisfied. I felt I could be doing something, you know, better, more. Something that would interest me more. And yeah, mainly I just, I was not happy. I was really not happy. Well, yeah, that that's the thing about UPS. It's 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 it is a tough job. It's it's not easy by any means. I mean, I wasn't a dr being a driver is a very difficult job. It's very physically taxing, but mentally as well, because you know you have daily deadlines and things that you need to meet and whatnot. And yeah, they, you know they do pay well, but you got, dude, you gotta, you gotta work for it, man. You, you gotta work for it. But you know, if dude, oh, if you're about to retire, oh, by the way, you know, you, I didn't know you were military, Garf. So, thank you for your sacrifice, man. I appreciate you, brother. Thank you for your service, man. Uh, but I would suggest doing like Amazon, who's a big competitor to UPS. Um, yeah, if you if you're not worried about the benefits, then be be a delivery driver for Amazon. I was thinking about doing DoorDash. Uh, you know, DoorDash, you you know, just deliver people's groceries and food and stuff. I was thinking about doing that. You know, make a little extra money on, on my days off and stuff. You know, something that's easy. You could probably do Uber, Garvey. You know, if you don't mind meeting new people and dealing with drunk folks from time to time. We have a uh, we have our resident Uber driver. Here in uh, on this channel, J Mess, he does work for Uber. Well, maybe he can uh, give you a little insight. All right, this is now box number nine. Need a big time hit. Where's the super fractor at? Ooh, male stripper. If you got the goods, Sam, there you go, Garv. Male stripper, the way to go. If the ladies can get paid for it, why can't we? I think you're onto something, Ron Ron. You know, I'm going to hit the gym hard for, for about two years. And then, uh, you know, turn over to stripping. Victor Mesa Jr. 499 Marlins.
Don't say that, Garv. Don't say that. I'm about to prove you wrong. Or I hope I am. Come on, hubby. Zach Collins to 125 White Sox. There you go, Robert. <laughs> Get on that treadmill, baby. Did, did you shave the head yet, uh, Rara? Brady Singer, Royals autograph. I feel our team would have hit there for Matt. You're waiting for the National to bust out the Baldy, huh? I see you. Drive the ladies crazy out there. I hear you, Garv. I uh, I fucked my shoulder up a couple years ago, and I haven't been to the gym since. <laughs> I laugh because it's the truth. Fernando Tatis Jr. Padres Atomic, MJ Melendez Royals Atomic. Kershaw, four nine nine Dodgers.
So, Rara, how you liking living up there in uh, California? Eh? I know you're out there on business, but I know you find time for a little pleasure. Have you dealt with more uh, earthquakes? Quake free, a. Hey. Yeah, I hear the same thing about uh, about the weather out there. It's comparable to Florida, but you know, not as humid. I'll probably go to California next year. Hot Rod G, where you at? Are you in California, Hot Rod, or Florida? Because I, I'm in that 305, baby. A solo home run by uh, Mr. Blackman of the Nationals. or well, not the National, the National team, I should say. Computer died. Oh, my boys in Jacksonville. Oh man, yeah. So you know, you know the, uh, you know the struggles. How you like it out there in Jacksonville? I've never been. You may have to go to Dallas week before national. Look at this guy just traveling all over. It must be nice. Well, I see a gold shimmer back there. <clears throat> Hopefully he's got some ink to go with it. This is box number 10 right now. Noel V. Marte to 50 Mariners. Brian Anderson, 25 Marlins. Man, Jacksonville is boring. Super boring. So I'm sorry you gotta uh, deal with that. People, people talk all the crap they want about Miami, but man, is it awesome living here? As far as you know, the cost of living sucks and the traffic is terrible. And some other people are rude. But when you get past that, Miami's awesome. Uh, I love Miami. There's always something to do. It's definitely not boring. I love it, man. I can't I can't do that small town living. 
No, no disrespect to anybody, but I, I'm a city boy. To 250, Jordan Adams, Angels. Brian Hayes, Atomic Pirates. Well, you can always go to the beach, Hot huh, Rod. Andrew uh, Kisner or Nisner, whatever. Four ninety nine Cardinals. We pulled the autograph out of this already. I think so, right? I guess not. Julio Pablo Martinez to 150. I know that's a big hit for the Rangers. There you go, Rangers. Where where are they at? Chris Fitz, finally a hit for one of your teams. Now the Rangers were bought straight up through the store. They were not part of the random uh, filler. Two boxes left.
box 11, almost done. Need a big time hit here, Bowman Hobby. A lot of people's without hits. Let's do something for them. Hero for the Brewers Atomic. Taylor Ward 250 Angels. Win 299 Rangers Jose de la Cruz 150 Tigers. Logan Webb to 250. Giants autograph. There you go, Han. Hit with your Giants. Jesus Lozardo, 250A's. Wow. 
And now, the last box mojo. So real quick, I have a Royal, a Mint, an Oreo. An Angel, a D-back, a Brave. Where are the Braves? There they go. A Cub, a Giant, a Ranger, a Philly, a White Sock, and a Marlin. Okay. So screen is up to date as far as teams that are left. Or I should say, as far as teams I got hit. The jumbo case is down to seven teams, from what I can see. We got Blue Jays, Marlins, Nationals. The Blue Jays, Marlins, Nationals, Rangers, Rockies, Royals, and the Yankees. I don't know who took teams, but thank you for those that did. Appreciate it. Let's see if we get that jumbo fill tonight. There's Brad Pitt in a space movie. What the hell? Ad Astro. Random. have come upon our last box good luck everybody here we go and the final hit is going to be a tiger Casey Mize So both of Mark's teams got a hit. Congrats, Mark.
Genesis Cabrera, Cardinals, Atomic. Louis Urias to 150. The Bowman Sterling Atomic Padres. Nate Nader to 150 Marlins. Yes, sir, Rara. Yes, sir. We'll put a filler together, see if we can crack that tonight. That way, tomorrow we can focus on gold standard. And there's that archives baseball stuff, too, which is very nice. One auto per box guaranteed. Yeah, we'll have a case of that. And the last deck here. Bo Burrows, 250 Tigers. Ugh. And that, my friends, is going to do it. Alright, so, let's do a... Uh, dang it, that's the wrong... So let's recap the autos. We got Mice Tigers, Singer Royals, Mauricio Mets, Mullins Orioles. Suarez Angels, 499. Alexander D Bags, 499. Wright Braves, 499. Thompson Cubs, 299. Webb Giants, 250. Martinez Rangers, 150. Stewart, Phillies 50, Jimenez, White Sox 25, and a yellow printing plate 101 for the Marlins, Victor Mesa Jr. So that's it for the recap. However, got to give away some break credit. So we're going to go seven times in the random. Take that down real quick. So you can see, grab everyone's name. They did not get a hit, unfortunately. And let's see if we can get a little redemption for them. Uh, actual redemption, but you, you know what I mean. Anyway, sort that out there. So the top 10 names will win $10 each in break credit. Let's get rid of that extra spot there. And go in seven times. Here we go. Top ten win. Good luck, everyone. Money shot seven. Boom, seven times. 
Top 10, we got Daisy twice, that's 20. Fits up there twice, that's 20. Leia once, 10. Uh, Garf twice, that's 20. Gary once, that's 10. Brad once, 10. Brandon once, 10. And there is the break, my friends. Thank you, everyone.